Lizzie and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a video all about health. It's really kind of hard to find the balance of being happy and healthy. I would either not work out and not try to be healthy or I would cut out anything that I loved with food. I've looked at my life and what's worked for me and what hasn't worked for me in the past. <laughs> oh my boy going through puberty. My voice is changing. Great. So I want to really connect with you guys. I want you to join me on this journey so to say. It would really mean a lot to me if we could do this together to have some support. I don't know if you guys need it. Y'all could be perfect and I'm just over here like please help me I need some help up in this bitch also last week I challenged you guys to get our video to 500 likes and you did it so I'm gonna challenge you this week to get it to 514 likes so, so let me know in the comments below if you're gonna try to be healthy with me I'm gonna document it on social media let's just get on into the video which is how to be healthy when you love food oh, I'm probably gonna eat so bad <laughs> When I was my healthiest and my happiest, I always found that eating three meals a day was not good for me. I much prefer having like five small meals throughout the day. It's just easier for my body to digest. Like, Also, I read online that was a good thing too, so I don't think I'm crazy on that. <laughs> Tip numero do. I try to exercise at least three times a week. Sometimes you just don't feel like working out. Sometimes you just want to sit in bed. Or maybe you want to watch all of Jessica Jones. It's okay. This is 2016. This isn't new. People like to binge Netflix and don't want to go outside or be social. If you are a foodie like me and you hear the word diet, you want to run in the other direction. My tip to you is to just not deprive yourself. And what works for me is not to have one cheat day. Say I'm at the salad bar at Whole Foods and I fill my whole thing up with salad, but I see mac and cheese is on the other side of the bar, I'll have mostly salad and then I'll like a dollop of mac and cheese. Dark chocolate really satisfies like my sweet tooth craving and this one company, JoJo's, sent me actually a whole thing of dark chocolate. It's got all natural casein protein, cranberries, almonds, and pistachios. Seven servings per container and 155 calories per serving and this whole thing was filled and I, I've gone through almost the entire thing. The health benefits, it boosts brain power, heart healthy, packs with antioxidants, it satisfies your cravings quickly, paleo friendly, no highs or lows, it balances your blood sugar, it's gluten free and it's non-GMO casein protein. So this is like my secret right now. I am absolutely obsessed with it. It's all about portion control, ladies and gentlemen. And that is the truth. My fourth tip to getting in shape and being healthy is to sleep. It is so important. I know so many people, there's a reason you get tired at night. You need to listen to your body and just go to bed. Turn off the computer and pass out. And my last tip, tip number five, is you need to eat fat to lose fat. I don't mean eat like five slices of pizza every night. Eat good fat, so avocados, salmon. So this is a really cool opportunity for foodies like me to test out new recipes, and you'll find that if you include these healthy fats, you will get in shape and still be happy because you're eating freaking awesome food. And end your day with a piece of chocolate and you will be happy. So get a buddy to join you on this journey. If you have a buddy that will just keep you accountable for your stuff, like if you have that craving, you can text them and be like, hey, and they'll be like, Lindsay, don't do it. And you'll be like, you're right, thank you. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you enjoyed these tips. If you enjoyed this video and you haven't yet subscribed, hey, you should. Also, Drunk Pinterest is premiering next, so make sure you subscribe so you get a notification when that video gets uploaded. I am so freaking, I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video, and um, bye.